Hey yo, this is Nick Moffitt with a new episode of Spring Cleaning Movie Project, in which I take every film off my shelf that I haven't seen and uh, review each one of them. Uh, so a couple days ago I watched Backdraft. Backdraft came out in 1991, stars Kurt Russell, William Baldwin, uh, Robert De Niro. Um, yeah, and it's directed by Ron Howard, the guy who's going to be doing uh, the new Solo movie uh, in a few months. So, um, yeah, Backdraft is, like, one of the big firefighting movies. I mean, I don't know, I can't, I definitely can't do a top ten firefighting movies. And this is one that, um, I've always wanted to see, like, even when I was a little kid, and I don't know how long, I don't know how long this VHS tape has been on my, on my, on my shelf that I haven't seen, but, yeah, I don't know, it's a movie that I've always, I've always wanted to see, I just haven't gotten around to it, and, yeah, I mean, it's pretty good, like, it's not bad, it's, uh, kind of like, just a movie, I guess, you know, it's, uh, it's pretty good for a firefighting movie, it's like, there's some really cool action scenes, um, you know, there's some drama, so the thing that, like, really, like, caught my attention was the way the fire was, like, kind of a entity of itself, like, the way it entered rooms was very ominous, and, like, 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 here it comes, the fire's coming to get you, and, um, I don't know, it kind of reminded me of Twister a little bit, like, Twister's one of my favorite, uh, 90s uh, disaster movies and one thing that's really fun about Twister is that the the, the tornado is like a, like a killer and it's coming after the family it's like a, it's like a slasher film and uh, so Twister is like a slasher film I kind of felt like backlash was like a mo- like a monster house like a haunted a haunted house where like they go into the house and then the fire is like coming out to get them and they have to like you know, deal with it, and you even had, like, the sound effect that came along with it, like, it was, like, it it was just, it was just reminded me of a monster, and then, uh, you know, they had to, they had to fight it off and stuff, um, the difference between, the big difference for me between Backlash and, and Twister is that Twister kind of knew what it was, it was, like, a silly disaster movie that was, like, really fun, uh, you know, Ron Howard can't help but be, like, cheesy and sappy and earnest and, you know, all's good in the world, uh, there's some real drama here, and, yeah, so, I don't know, Backlash was kind of trying to be, like, a serious drama, except it had a lot of silliness with it, um, I mean, it was, it was definitely, like, fun to watch, it was a little long, um, I would say, you know, it's, if you're interested in firefighting movies, like, I can, I honestly can't think of too many other ones, like, I've seen, like, Lara 49, and, um, so, I mean, the fire scenes were, like, pretty cool, um, I was reading about them, though. It sounds like they weren't very realistic <laughs> in a lot of ways. Um, so, um, from what I've heard, like, it's hard to, like, actually make, like, realistic firefighting movies because that wouldn't be a good movie. Just uh, a, lot of, a lot of smoke and uh, wearing masks and stuff. In this movie, they were just kind of, like, out there with their, you know, without their masks on, just inside the building, just, you know, throwing the water down. So, um... I don't know, uh, would I recommend it? Um, maybe not, but, uh, if you're interested in the subject, then, yeah, probably. So, anyway, thanks for watching, have a nice day.